Hey, what's going on? This is your boy DJ Marcus. And you know what? I'm done. I'm finished. Kaput. My DSLR gots to go. I'm going to tell you why right after this. So check this out. So I am not a professional uh, photographer or videographer. I'm just a novice at this thing. But I've been us using the, my uh, my Sony Alpha 77-2. Had this for a while now, and it's a great camera. I love the camera. Uh, it does very well. I've shot some pretty good videos for work and personal business. Um, from my DJ gigs or things over abroad and overseas. This has done me very, very well. But the problem is, is that with the camera and the lens and the other lens, and let's not even talk about if we're gonna do something really serious with like uh, shoot some, some videos, then I have this monstrosity of a rig here. And then we have the mics and the lights and all that, yo son, it's just too much. I can't, I can't, I can't carry all that. There's too many things going on. And now with technology, I'm looking for something that's a little bit more compact, a little bit more, more suitable to be able to carry, um, yet still have the same quality. So, a couple years ago, I ran across a product for my, I say a couple years ago, <laughs> my iPhone 4, and this is um, MCAM. MCAM made this, um, this dock. It's very nice. It's made out of steel. Very strong, very sturdy. And it kind of looks like, uh, like a joystick. But um, you put your lens, it has a, um, a lens that goes there, and you can um, film and shoot, take photos and videos with this. And this is a great, this is a great piece of gear here. It has a cold shoe as well, so I can throw a light or a microphone there. Great thing. Problem is, it's only made for the iPhone 4. So, Oops, I can't use it any longer because my iPhone 4 is gone. But, they made another version. So, the next year when I upgraded my phone from a 4, I went to the iPhone 6 Plus. And guess what? MCAM, which now changed their name to ALM, sorry, it's a little dusty here, they made another dock. It's great, great dock. It either came with a nice little, uh, a little uh, neoprene or plastic cover there, which which made it nestle real nice neat into that. Perfect. This does, did great. Well, great until, guess what? I had to upgrade my phone again because I'm an iPhone nut. I love iPhone. So when the next phone comes out, I go up to the next phone. But this time I took a break. I didn't go to the 8. I jumped to the 10. So, can't use it no more. So what do we do now? You know, I'm looking, I'm looking, and trying to find something that's suitable. But this time I wanted something that would grow with my phones. I didn't want to have to buy another rig every time I upgrade my phone. So I found a great product. It is B-Script. Now, if you're not familiar with B-Script, this is great. It works for your iPhone or your Android or if anybody's still using Microsoft phones, Blackberry maybe, I don't know. But if, anyway, it can work for any phone. I, I got this two days before going to Amsterdam for ADE and I, I was able to use it so I wanted to test it out so real world road testing I took it out I left all of my other gear here I left my DSLR beautiful lovely Sony but I left it out I left my Sony lenses and all that and I just took my iPhone 10 and my Beats grip and I'll tell you what amazing I love that. I love the portability of it. I love that it's very light. It's not made of metal. Um, it's made of, of harder plastic and it has some copper uh, joints in there where you can screw in your, your, shoe, your shoes and, and your different devices there. And it worked very well for me. Now, this may not be for everybody. Let me make the disclaimer. This is not for everybody, but for me and what I'm looking to do and for, for the videos that I shoot, for the films that I'm doing, things of that nature, for the music videos, this is a perfect solution for me. So, tested it out, everything's great. And I'll show you all that, give you a full breakdown of that here. Now, so since I've gone away from the DSLR, 
I'm trying to go and put everything in the iOS family. Since I'm using my iPhone 10, then hey, I need to find something to record video correctly. So I use an app called Filmic Pro. Great app. It lets you be. It allows you to be able to manipulate your lens, your 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 um, your magnification. It's chock full of a lot of very useful features. Check on YouTube. There's a plenty, a plethora of Filmic Pro videos on it. So check it out. Filmic Pro is a great app that I use. Now, editing. You know, um, I used to edit on Final Cut Pro. You know, love Final Cut Pro. I used to also edit on Adobe Premiere. But, you know, again, I'm trying to get things in the box. I want these things to be a little faster. I want to be able to edit quicker. I want to be able to capture something and then be able to edit it and then push it up to the web, to my website, to YouTube as quickly as possible. So, um, big shout out to my boy Henny the Business down in the A. I'm in the COT up here in Charlotte. But Henny, I was researching on YouTube and I ran across a video where he recommended a great app that I use and I use a lot now called LumaFusion. If you don't know about LumaFusion, check it out. Built for iOS, built for the iPads, built for the iPhones. When I went to Amsterdam, I have LumaFusion on my iPhone 10 and on my iPad, but I did all my editing on the iPhone 10. I shot the videos on, on the iPhone 10, utilizing my B script. And, and speaking on the B script, I bought the lenses. There are two lenses that you can buy additional, additional with it. Um, this is the fisheye lens. It comes and it has a macro, you unscrew it, there's a macro lens in there as well. Great piece of glass there. And then there's a wide angle one as well. So what I'm shooting on right now is actually the wide angle lens. I have actually two of them. And the video quality, the, 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 the scope of it, absolutely fantastic. So this is my recommendation. You know, let me know what you think about it. If you agree with me, hey, give me a thumbs up. If you don't agree with me, hey, give me a thumbs up anyway. And this is your boy DJ Marcus. Just wanted to give you a couple of reasons why I gave my DSLR the boot. Make sure you subscribe and like the video, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.